Ah, I see what's going on now. That makes a lot of sense. I was muted. Exerisa, Kataria, and Ash. And the Prime Fox. <clears throat> Next is Prime Ashton. And the resub demonic. Hold on, quick text message. Thanks to Tier 1 Oreo, the resub Freeze, and the Bits Euphoric. Do we make winner's bracket? Yeah, we did. We're winner's bracket. So I get to sleep in a little bit tomorrow. I get up at 8 a.m. instead of 5 a.m. Here's some Thursim, Prison, and Sauce. Is Exoprimal not good? Caleb played it and said he fucking loved it. I thought it looked fine. I was going to try it. Probably still will. But now I've seen two people, including Dankin, say it's not very good. Thanks to Resub, Toaster, Penguin, Ja, and the Bits, Abaria, and Matt. We're winners bracket in Apex, so we play again tomorrow at 9 a.m. Or, yeah, tomorrow at 9 a.m. We tried J. Schlatt's Titty Milk Gamer Sups. That shit slaps. Yeah, it was actually very good. There's a Prime City. Doctorio and Tier 1 drink. In the Prime, Marcelo. He played WWE 2K23. <clears throat> yeah, we played a little 2K23. Not a ton. Next to the Prime, Rough and the Resub, Soul and Dino. I am not that close to Final Fantasy 16 completion yet. I haven't played in like three days now. Had a lot going on with like Apex and I've just been super tired from getting up at fucking 5 a.m. Because I can't, I can, I literally can't go to sleep before midnight. So I get no sleep at all. Thanks to resub cats. I have not done the next icon after Titan yet. I feel like I'm about to though. Thanks to resub Luke and Vampire. I'm just gonna just pulled up an exo primal thing. Will you replay Cyberpunk? Yes, for the DL well, when the DLC comes out I will play it. I'm not gonna like replay it. It's DLC and not a new game.
Thanks to the resub milty in Bohemian. Which ending did you get from Cyberpunk? Ah, uh, fuck, I actually don't even remember the ending now. It's the one where we uh, drive away off into the sunset. It's like the pseudo-happy ending, but I don't think it's like the true ending. I actually can't even remember what happens now, it's been so long. Thanks a bit, Jake, hope you had a good concert. Yeah, 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 Pan Am ending. It was a Pan Am ending. Have you seen Undertime Slopper? No, but that's a really cool name. And no, I didn't hear about that story at all, Mudo. Thanks for your subs off, Willy and Carlos. Okay, I had to send a quick text. Thanks for five gift subs, Lemon, and the resub Gabo. Have you read the Walking Dead comics? No. I have not. Is the resub rainy night in stable? Mass Effect has some cool comics. I didn't even know they made comics. That's cool. Thanks, Eurisub, Autumn, and DJ. The Bits, Beaches, and George. Never even heard of that game, George. Skibbity Toilet Mobile Game, huh? No. Is your sub Kurafin? Whoops. Kurafin and the bits raw. And the give sub Glaceon. Yeah, I used to play the shit out of Bloons TD. Would you want to advertise your game on a stream titled Bad Game Night? That seems super counterintuitive. Wish you luck with your game though, but yeah, I don't know about that. That just sounds mean. Thanks for your support, Storm. Nice doing business with ya. What a concept for a game! I was wondering when the gameplay starts, and then I realized this is the gameplay. You just organize inventories, master inventory management, while interacting with the enigmatic merchant. 
So they just took the merchant from Resident Evil and the concept of the Resident Evil inventory and you just manage it. That's, f that's fucking wild. And you see the news about the stolen tractor chase in Georgia that ended at a Waffle House? Yeah, it did. I did see that. <gasps> oh my God. What a trailer. I think this is supposed to be for TikTok or something. That's why they're 18 seconds long. What? The voice acting's good though. Thanks for the gift sub Atlanta and the resubs in. I'm just going through new releases, Italic. So if it's there, I'm maybe. Thanks for the resub Crease and Bobcat. The resub Shelly it in hell. And the bits dung. Thoughts on the writer strike delaying the new season of the boys in Deadpool 3. Hey. Is what it is. I'm on the writer's side, man. That's fine. I'm very excited for both of those, but I'd rather the writers get paid fairly. So I'm fine with it. Oh, they got a new golf game. Thanks to the gift sub, Seba, and the resub, Bo, Sammy, and the prime potato. What a shitty take. What? About the writers getting paid better? <laughs> It's like the most basic take ever. The floor is yours every night, Riot. Why Why don't writers deserve better pay? I'd love to hear a reasonable explanation. You seem like a reasonable guy. While well, I look at some dog shit on Steam here. Make your case. God, this looks boring, holy shit. Thanks to resub meal, paper plane, and the prime dilly. Shitty writing. Oh, every single thing ever written is shitty? So you don't watch any movie, TV shows, or play any games? Or read anything? Damn, okay. That's fine then, yeah. You're making a good point. Is this an official Dragon Quest game? This world's full of treasure and it's ours for the wow, taking. nobody's playing this. Dragon Quest is a huge huge property. Only four reviews on that bad boy. Okay, I overstated. Not shitty, I just think some of the writers are really milking the whole situation when they've been making absolute garbage. That's just such a- how old are you? That has to be like a child's take. Bad writing exists, thus every writer doesn't deserve to be fairly compensated. So by that extension, since there's shitty players in the NBA, no athletes deserve any money. In every field, there's going to be good and bad. 
But the bad doesn't mean that it speaks for the whole industry. Oh, this is a breathtaking first-person shooter. Okay. Cod zombies, huh? Cool. That is quite breathtaking. Thanks to the resub Cajun Laser Dystopia Axel Cheeto Kuri in the Bits Atlanta and Dung. the resub dancing no we're just going through the new releases that's how we do bad game night so that way it's a game literally no one's ever heard of it makes it a nice enjoyable ex well enjoyable might be a stretch because these games are fucking miserably bad a unique experience because no one's ever seen it before plus then I hold the speed run record when I beat it because no one else has he's a bit George We did bad game night on the Nintendo Switch literally like two days ago with Last Hope. And then we went right into Illusion after that. Though that game wasn't bad, it was just really boring. Thanks the resub plant in Vojo. The writer of She-Hulk made $396 in residuals from Disney. Well, residuals are fucking non-existent in the writing industry, which is one of the big problems. I couldn't stand She-Hulk. I thought that show had horrible writing. But she should still deserved to get paid for the fucking work. Yeah, it shouldn't be a hot take. And I don't think it is for most reasonable people. Things with tier one toy in the resub stag and slippin'. Hmm. Can't tell if this might be fun bad or just boring bad walking sim horror. It seems more like boring bad walking sim horror. I like the idea of the GoPro perspective though, that's cute. And it looks good. Like visually. But nothing happens. Not even in their own trailer. Mm. Yeah, it just seems like normal walking sim. Thanks to resub Scoob and give sub toy and the prime Rosie. Don't know if it's true, but I heard executives want executives want to own actors' likeness to use in AI, but without having to pay them every time they use them. Yeah, that was a big article a few days ago. They want to give a one-time payment so that way they can digital or, Jesus digitally have AI assimilate <laughs> them and make a model of them so that way they can use that so they don't have to keep paying them every day. Yeah, that that is a real thing.
It was a one-time 200 payment for perpetuity. Yeah, I don't think the payment of $200 is going to be across the board. I imagine that's going to vary from roll to roll. But but it is something they are doing, yeah. Little one, when you play, don't you mind what you say? Who feeds but won't say? This may be your last day. Things that reach Holy Spirit, Thai, Glump, Blood, BKM, and the gift sub long live. And the bits, Courtney. You have come this far, but you won't make it further without our help. Eh, boring. Wait. Another boring ass walking sim. Oh, Exo Primal. We were just talking about that. <clears throat> Those capybars are cute. These are five gift subs Poland. The Prime Muffin and Resub Clankton. How overdone do you think lullabies are in horror? Oh, yeah. Extremely overdone. Obviously. Every horror game and horror movie has a lullaby moment. Real Drift Multiplayer. Cool. Testament, the Order of High Human, huh? That sounds cool. Thanks the Prime, Yada Lock, and the Resub Aesthetic. What have you done to yourself, young man? They paid the price for their indifference. When There's like real effort stops, in here. No one spared. Mm. Your bow is ready. Put your hand here. Let me show you. IGN everything. gave this a two. Bearer of the orb, claim thus power. May the truth enlighten you. The gate of hope, the birthplace of a seeker. We sought to make it a beacon of light, and then came the Garaks. Worshippers of darkness, all hopes had gone. Tessa so why did they give it a two? On the path of ruin. Is it just like super boring? In darkness. Or is it broken? I don't really want to watch the light. review. This looks like it could be fun bad. Not to guide, but to annihilate, to cleanse. As the meaning of light is the vanquish of darkness. A reward for raising the seeker. The divine gear of protection. Amidst all Review darkness, said the game's like 40 hours long and a ton of random of ideas and none of them are done well. Rise, mm. chosen one. Bear the testament. The ultimate weapon of light. Save your realm. Be the guardian. Destroy the tree of darkness. I have to know what makes it bad. I don't want to. I really don't want to do a boring bad game. 
like even accidentally. So let me see, what makes this bad? Yeah, here's someone who 100% of the game, jeez, uh, Godspeed to, to you. Wow. <laughs> wow. That is commitment. Thanks, Reese Taz, Dookie, and Sean. Thank What's going Jack on, everybody? Prime, Mortem here. Recent this time, and Prime you my review after 100% for Testament, Order of High Human, which is a first-person action adventure on both combat and puzzles. The devs and the publisher, Fairy Ship Games, have advertised that this game is inspired by a lot of titles, but is very much so trying to recreate the feel of more retro titles like Dark Messiah of Might and Magic, in Great addition game. to some distinctive Metroidvania elements. So, needless to say, we have a lot to cover. For newly released games, I like to start the video off with a bit of a note on the technical state of the game, and I personally didn't really have too many problems in the way of bugs Okay, so it's not like broken. That. Most of what I ran into was very minor stuff. Enemies have more health. Mostly, I just wanted to mention it because the option is a little bit buried. It's not kind of put in your face. From there, though, let's talk about the story setup for this game. In this particular Ooh. title, we is play as a man named Arin, who has recently found himself stripped of all his power by his brother Arva, who has usurped the throne of high humans from you. You used to be the king of the immortal race known as the high humans. This was effectively a group of people that was. This doesn't even sound bad. Above 20 hours, roughly 25-ish to see everything in one go, as the game does have a fair bit of optional content. Now, as far as the quality of that story goes, the story and the world itself are pretty interesting. I was curious about nice. the world that they had built. Past it must just be bad gameplay. Secrets. So there is a tiny bit of backtracking, but thankfully, due to the fast travel system, this is mostly RTM. streamlined and you can target exactly what you're looking for, which makes the extra exploration and discovery, if you will, of the side content pretty targeted and it's not really looking to waste your time or anything. But then there's the platforming sections. As I mentioned, the game primarily focuses on combat and puzzles. Much I don't know, it just looks like it'll end up being boring bad. Into combat encounters or just explore. depending on how However, many of there these are there parts are of the game that are series of platform eh, i don't even think it's worth the risk i don't feel like playing something boring give me something fun bad the jump was kind of rough yeah i mean it's not like a triple a game it's not trying to be makes it a sub gauge Oh, here's the ED Zero Zombie Uprising someone mentioned. This is like a popular game. Hi, Domo Perides, Zombie Orchid, at the Mighty Hey, D3 Publisher. They do EDF. This looks fun. This doesn't even look bad. Why'd you say this is bad? This looks like fun. D3 pumped out some just genuinely fun games. Yeah, it's supposed to be like goofy Japanese. That's the whole vibe of the game. At least that's what I'm getting from it. No, we're not gonna play this. We're looking for bad games. Not good games. And that, that looks good. I actually thought that looked very fun.
Thanks, Resub Josiah, and the bits loaded. Why don't you have text-to-speech? I turned that off, like, five years ago. People donate money to try and, like, make chat laugh and end up spending so much money doing that, and they just spend way too much money on text-to-speech gags. So I turned it off, and then I eventually just turned off donations, because I don't want donations. At least with a sub, you get emotes for it. What is this? This is a ton of reviews. Well, this, this does not look like a bad game. Man, where's all the fun bad games at right now? We're deep and haven't found a single fun bad one. Things are you sub sarcastic. Things you resub Lacona. Another back rooms game. Is you some golfing? Greed of man. This also has a lot of reviews, mostly negative. So you live in a town ran by real players. Alright. I'm gonna check this one out. I wanna see what kind of town they've got cooked up over there right now. So it's just Gmod RP. Doesn't really seem Gmod esque. We'll see. Seems very bare bones. What the fuck? What is it called again? I already forgot what the name was. Oh, Greed of Man. That's what it was. There it is. <clears throat> okay. We'll give it a whirl. Thanks, you Resub. Distro, Grim, David, and Nate. Things they resubmit. All right, let's see how greedy these men are. They got Daft Punk on the banner there. That's kind of hype. Give me something good. No. Oh. This is so tedious. This is so tedious. All right. There's your Jinsai. Hold on. Got to make an account. I think I think I'm all set. Actually, that was much easier than I thought. It looked like it was going to be many steps. All right, let's get it. Thanks, Risa Brock. No, I didn't hear that karma. 
Let me make sure this shit isn't like open mic or something. Doesn't have anything about it. I guess we'll see. Is this a player? No, this is the item manager, or the manager. Okay, so how do I be the fast food trainee? Is it just not ready yet? How do I get this off my screen? Uh, I can see myself moving around here in the fog. Oh, this is the... Wait, they just have the dev console in here? Off rip? Wow. Huge. How do I close this? I've tried, like, everything on the keyboard. I don't think there's, like, a single normal key. I don't think there's a single normal key that I haven't pressed yet. Oh, got it. I think it was Z. I'm gonna roll the dice, I'm gonna try again. It's X. <laughs> That's so cute, it's fucking X. Huge. Thanks, you said Beastie Baker, Starship, and the Bits Karma. Alright, so there's apparently eight players in this bitch, I wanna go find them. Oh, there's one. Oh, he's gonna tase me. Uh, how do I put my hands up? Wonder what he. Wonder what he's gonna do. How do I? Does he work here? How does he have a job here? It wouldn't let me. What the fuck, man? How does it... Uh, there's a the Ethereum loco and apocalyptic. You have to be in uniform. Well, he didn't give me a fucking uniform. Where am I supposed to get it? Enjoy your dough, Erica. God, this place is popping off. Thanks, Arisa Blinken and Abe. I'm gonna go find one of the other seven players. This guy's come over here and then blue screened in his brain, I guess. Where are the other players at? God, I hope it's not open mic. I'd be so embarrassed. Seven forty seven sweets. This place is a mess. shot. Did that come from outside or did one of the remaining seven players just kill himself in one of the hotel rooms here? I can't believe I spent $20 on this. I'm ending it. I've had enough. Where was it?
No, it's just not free. It's twenty dollars and it was on sale. Where did that shot come from? I really want to know. Oh my god, how big is this building? Jesus. Imagine getting this room here. They were really ambitious. They thought they'd have a huge player base. Oh my god, that just scared the shit out of me. Hold on one second. Alright, I'm back. Thanks for your subgalactic robot Abe and the Prime Fran. Man, imagine being the stupid asshole that buys this penthouse suite. There's no elevator or anything quick to get down, so here comes a 20 minute run downstairs. Man, the greed of man is charging for this game. Good lord. Things are resub chapel. There we go. Maybe I can get a job at the pharmacy. How do I... How do I get out of this menu you now? There's nothing I want. Okay, you just run away. What are the reviews like on this game? Hold on. Is there something I'm missing? I know it has overwhelmingly negative reviews, but... There's gotta be something to it, right? There's gotta be something. It's not even coming up on the Steam store now. Is it- what is this game called? Is it not Greed of Man? Oh, there we go. So everything is not recommended. I cannot recommend this game for two simple reasons. Why the fuck are we used to create an account by using login steam on your website? <laughs> it's true, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, dude's got my fucking Steam info now, I guess. This is just a disaster, you can't really do anything, this is just a scam game. 
I didn't play much, but can already see the game's bad. Don't support Nick. He's a scammer and not even a real game developer. He abandoned his only two other games and already gave up on this game before stating he's in way over his head. He heavily advertised this game as free just a few months ago and is now making 3k a month on Patreon for making literal garbage. Wait, how deep does this rabbit hole go? I'd like to introduce you all to- What the fuck? Did I just fall for a big scam? Well, I mean, the game sucks ass. Like, there's nothing to do here. It is a scam, but, like, is it, like, a well-known scam? This TikTok star is scamming his audience with fake games. I fell for a scam. I'm not his audience, and I still got scammed. To Nick, a self-proclaimed game developer- Son of a who bitch! A ...following of almost 750,000 followers on TikTok, promoting his now-released early access title called Greed of Man. Oh, that's what I'm playing right now! Developer, I don't say that lightly. See, Greed of Man is a brand new role-playing game where you can live out your wildest fantasies, become a criminal, manufacturing and selling narcotics. No, I saw the trailer. There's nothing in here. If not millions of dollars in crowdfunding, ending up going nowhere with no real, tangible games to satisfy the massive number of people buying into them. But in order to talk about daddy. Greed of Man, we have to go back to the beginning of Nick's TikTok and game dev career. So, I can't believe it. <laughs> Man, Nick bad game night got me scammed. Space on September 14th, yeah, I have to, I have to change my shit here. Game called Tomorrow's Past, with the caption reading, Yes, I'm developing my own game for Xbox, PS4, and PC. And what followed was a oh, lot let me of get to the greed of man stuff. TikToks, a solo developer creating a game that rivals GTA, as Nick was trying to imply. That's no easy. That's feat. a cool Something face. Nick finally admitted to Crimson on Chin. October 30th, 2022, with a two minute long TikTok detailing various challenges he ran into along the way. I have some unfortunate news regarding the development of my game. About a year ago today, I started work on a huge project that was way out of scope of what I was capable of. I was planning to make a multiplayer game where you could like own businesses and stuff with your friends. Basically, I was just trying to make a game that already existed, GTA Online. And this became a huge <laughs> issue as of a couple weeks ago when I realized uh. that my workflow was not going to finish this game in time. This game would take in time for what, man? Like what? You you don't work for a publisher? You your own boss? In time for what? What are you talking about, brother? God, I got scammed by a 16-year-old surfer frat douchebag. Uh, that was twenty dollars right down the shitter too. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna refund it, but he still gets the twenty dollars, unfortunately. Man, and it looks so good too. To think, if only a developer who cared had their hands on this, they could make Catnap Homes a real success. I'll take one more last look around this beautiful world before saying my goodbyes to it. Damn you, Nick! Damn you! Oh my god, there's another victim of the scam. That's probably Nick himself. Charles, turn off that video, it's a lie! The game's great, I'm still working on it. Give me time! Hey! Hey, Buster, can you hear me? It's supposed to be like an RP style game, but there's no settings for like voice, so I'm guessing that's not actually here. And there's also only one audio setting, which is voice, but with no way of getting voice. Hey, you stupid asshole, stop! If you can hear me, stop running. I'll give you a hundred Roblox if you stop running. Yeah, if he could hear me, he would have stopped for sure on the Robux. Let's see what he does. There's two of you? No, these have to be these have to be bots. No way. No way. No, nah, no shot. Bots. These are some Nico, Tigris, and Denim. Okay. I'm gonna refund this so that way Nick doesn't get all of my my twenty dollars here. 
I want to see how much he or how often he scams. Hold on, what's this TikTok doing right now? Because this is this is brand spanking new scam here. This is fresh off the press. I was one of the early adopter victims here. <laughs> that doesn't feel good. Give me two seconds. I'm just getting the refund in. Yeah, I'm going to go change my shit in just a second. Hold on. Okay, refund notice is in. Let me change my Steam <laughs> information. So, it, here, before I finish the video on Nick, I think... Let me, let me run through how I think this goes. I think what's happened here is Nick has made games like this, which are basically like GTA Online or... Roblox, open world, come in, come on. And what happens is when you try and play the game, you have to sign up on his website, which I did. And you have to link your Steam, which I did. Like an absolute buffoon. So I think what he does then is he maybe sells your information somewhere. I don't think he uses it. Like, I don't think he actually logs into accounts to steal things. I think he's just more of a data harvester type. That's my guess. Yeah, I know. I, I'm doing that right now. Give me a second. I'm I've gotta <laughs> I've gotta go through quite a few hoops here now. Nick has made this very inconvenient. What a piece of shit. What a piece of shit, man. <sighs> Give me just a second. I'm actually so upset, I'm not going to lie. There's the bits grump in Atlanta, in the Prime Utopian. Oh, man. in the fuck man Jesus Christ why is this so complicated damn you Nick fuck all right hold on give me a second now I gotta go do something else
Thinks it's tier one leg. This is so many steps. Okay. I've now reset everything. Okay. I think we're good now. Thanks for your sub Cyboy and Neon. And the bits Kurofin and the Prime Stormy. I have to see what his TikTok's doing right now. I because I already know that's exactly what the plan was, which is why he has you sign up on Steam to his website. Let's see. So, Big Fry just reviewed. Here he's he's addressing the scam video that I had up just a minute ago. My game, calling me a scammer. Now. I'm a 17-year-old in high school, so... I got scammed by a fucking 17-year-old! God! Jesus! Uh, I was kidding about calling him 16. He's actually a 17-year-old. Wow. Ugh, unlucky. I don't exactly have all the time in the world to be developing. So, the fact that this adult that does YouTube video reviews on scam games is going to take my small project and call it a scam simply because the audience grew so fast and I gained so much traction and I didn't deliver, like, the next GTA 6. What? And again, the game's in early access state. I'm not done with it. I just wanted to get a couple people in to try testing things and... Testing what things? Nothing worked. It was an empty world that I couldn't interact with anything. There, this is literally, he's just lying. It's $20 for an open asset world. All just asset flips. And you can't even interact with anything because it doesn't work. Bug fixing and adding new ideas that they come up with. And that's why the server sizes were only like 16 people. I wasn't expecting thousands of people that just jump into the game right away so my sh thousands of people didn't jump into the game you had a peak player kind of like 50 brother uh. servers could not keep up and you can't be comparing my game to like extremely successful and long-lived developments and projects by big companies no one is again, you didn't make a I'm game a schooler. i'm still living life this isn't the only thing i do like, you can't be calling my game a scam just because I didn't deliver some extremely amazing product to you. You didn't deliver I mean, a product. It honestly is a passion project of mine that I was just <laughs> doing for fun. And it just so happened to gain a ton of traction. And it's kind of messed up to call it a scam, too, because scams are something where you get your money taken and you don't get anything out of it. That's exactly. This you just defined your game. I, I, I am now one of the victims here. That is your game. It is the textbook definition of a scam that you just recited. It's a Steam game. You can buy the game, and if you don't like it, you refund it. It's not a scam. You keep your money. But I, I did refund it. I power trip by calling things shit and calling things scams, so I'll let him do his thing. So... What do the comments say? Damn. Comments eat him alive. Does he have fans? Oh, God. I found his burner. He even hearted it. I feel for you. The amount of hate is insane for a game that is genuinely good. You shouldn't focus on the hate. It only brings you down. From an account called Anonym. That's absolutely his burner. The game is not genuinely good. It's not a game. It's, it, it wasn't a game. There wasn't anything in it. You couldn't do anything. 
And I really do think the main purpose of it was data harvesting. There's no reason why in order to play that game you'd have to sign up on Nick's personal website with your Steam account. That is actually a phishing scam that I fell for in 2023. I di it didn't even cross my mind. I thought this was just some kind of shitty game from an actual studio. I didn't know it was one 17-year-old kid. Man, that's rough. We tried to warn you. I didn't see it. I don't know. I, I love playing shitty games. I didn't expect to get like legitimately scammed by one. Multiple years, if not... Finally released on Steam, and he's asking for thirty dollars, albeit on discount for thirty. So this is going over all the history of his other projects that he gives up on and throws away. Of marketplace assets. There's a user on TikTok by the name of Evo Ferrier. Ferrier. <clears throat> I, I don't know how to pronounce he's a tier it. One. But he's a game developer. Killer. And he's been there's some Seaberg and Gerudo. Nick on just using and slapping together marketplace assets, and this guy has basically recreated what Nick has made. Nick, this is following up on my most recent video. Within around three hours, I have created this game. Thanks, Reese Fisher. Your building system and is made. Are you just wanting more money and you don't care about the community? But I find it pretty crazy. We went from free to play to this. Yeah, is Nick I playing? I don't think so. <laughs> yeah. So there is, there is VoIP. It's just those two goobers weren't talking to me. It's like three o'clock in the morning. He's probably yeah. too busy blow drying his hair. <laughs> <laughs> Nicholas. <laughs> uh, okay, interact, Sally. Um. Yeah, it looks about right. He's a resub ancient. He's got nothing. So what the fuck do you actually do? Wait, everyone's nothing. Naked. How do you get like money or like get a job in this or you know get clothes? Uh, there's like the police officer. Like, no, is, like, it runs great for me. So um, oh yeah, there's fli there's flickers that? all over the place on my screen. Why is that? Oh, because he's not a real game developer. Uh, I don't and then you could do like the drug stuff, but you need to get some money to do that first. Can I get out of these fucking tidy whities they're like illegal businesses, like he said. Thanks, you should, um, Tim. And his like video. Cause the, there's doesn't really seem there's much that you could do. Yeah, it's it's cause there's I don't think there is. Like I'm pretty sure this is just an asset pack like thrown together. It like, is. Game. Yeah. What should you do if a naked man runs a? Oh. Crowd? I'll get a job. Like I want to be. A I didn't even find the police exam. What should you do? If Here's a the content. Man runs across the road. Like them for jaywalking. You're on duty. You happen to consume some drugs. What? Oh, then I change into my okay. Thanks, bud. So this is that must There's be the like only thing that works. Do. The only thing I this didn't try. Sucks. Oh, uh, where you get the back? Oh, are you a cop? Thanks, yeah. you some mayhem. Well, then you ain't getting the fucking backpack, kid. It's a cop backpack. It's for cops. Is there like a non-cop backpack? Fuck no, get? no backpacks in this. I mean, it's trash. And look at this. Just run right off the fucking thing. Yeah, for sure. Oh, that's kind of hype that's though. Now you Nick has been taking your money and making <sighs> asset flips Damn. that take no effort at all and he's cashing in. What a hassle this was. What a fucking hassle. <sighs> I am now I'm gonna be far more conscientious on Steam bad game nights. This made it very inconvenient having to fucking change everything. All right, on to the next one. Where was it? Like, what was the date on it? Did I pass it? Yeah, I must have passed it. Oh, here it is. That's where we left off. There's the prime. Choo choo. The recent pumpkin. I've been doing bad game nights for fucking four years, and I've never had something like that happen. The closest thing I got to scammed in the past was I downloaded a game on Steam that didn't have the, like, actual executable file in it. Which is like, okay. <laughs> that, that is a scam, but 
the very least, it didn't steal my fucking Steam login information. Crazy Flasher 7. Thanks, are you some Cadillac? Still better than Super Fight? Nah, Super Fight was pretty awesome. This does look like some American freedom farming. What do you what do you do though? Alright, I'll try it. This looks interesting. Give me just a moment. Thanks to the resub veto. Since I reset my whole account, I have to redo quite a few things here. You should try the long drive. I have. Thanks, Resub Cadence and Boss. Thanks to Tin Gifts Subzali, appreciate it. And the resub Infinite Fusion. I think I'm all set. Time for some freedom. Thanks to the resub Christopher. Sweet home. Let's get in it. Hey, how do I start farming? Do I like shoot it? Oh yeah. Now this is good old red-blooded God-fearing patriotic farming. I tell you what. How, how much do I have to do, though? But 
does it auto harvest or no? How do I harvest it? Do I need to get like a Budweiser out or something? Like what do I do? I feel like half this corn's ready. Oh, maybe I have to do the other field too. Oh! How do I use this? Okay, that doesn't work. Oh, because he had no ammo? Oh, I see. I didn't even realize there was ammo. How do I harvest the corn? Something with this, maybe? In the silos? Do I just sit here and fucking wait? Is that- is that it? Is this just a waiting game now? I think you have a harvesting gun? No, this is all I have. Whoa! If I scroll like really hard, I get all the other stuff, but if I just go, if I just try and do like a little bit, I stay on this, but I can't use any of this. There's a harvesting pistol. Where? I mean, that's what I'm using. Oh, this isn't the same pistol. All right, this is exhilarating. And for only $7. God, I hope this is enough corn to level up. How long do I have to hold F down for, huh? Get close to the truck and hold F to sell. That's what I've been doing. Okay, maybe- okay, it doesn't want corn. Corn's all I got, man. No, no wait. Where where do where do I get the the peppers? Maybe you can change ammo. How? Oh! It's E. I 
There's a resub Skynet and tier 1 spoon, tier 1 trickster in the resub accessory. Yeah, I know, I divine. Okay, I hope a hundred peppers is enough. Okay, I see. Said Tex, Mario, Meruem, and Scrappy. How much money do I have? Not much. God, I really hope I don't have to use the harvesting pistol for the whole game. <clears throat> Surely there's got to be more effective ways of harvesting. That's a lot. Looking good. Bind, shoot to scroll. Probably can't do that. Wouldn't be a bad idea though. Alright, we're starting to scale though. We're entering mid game. Nate. Oh yeah, we got a lot going on here. Oh, here we go. A good harvester. Okay. What am I what do I need? Oh yeah. That's trash! Holy fuck, the machine gun is so much better. Thanks, Risa Brian. This is fantastic, though. This harvester is amazing. The planter is fucking cheeks, though. I'll stick with the machine gun for planting. I've got my green thumb now. Oh, we've got artillery. I'm assuming. I'm assuming this will be a, a big one for me. Let's get let's get some good good crops to harvest this season. Wow, it was a carpet bombing run. I completely wasted it. Son of a bitch.
See, like, this is the technique right here. I'm out of ammo. Well, let's just really stock up. Time to harvest. Let's get a good vantage point. Let's clear let's clear all of this. Okay. All right, we are stocked up. That's big for us, that's big for us. Oh, and I can easily get through this next truck too without any hassle, thanks to all of my pre-planning. Yes, sir! Almost have enough for that too. This is trash, I'm never using that again. Okay, I've got some artillery and now I know how it's used, so let's... Okay, that should plant most of this field, right? Or does it always come in at the same angle? Soiled it! Guess they're not coming back. Damn, that's rolling too far. No! No! Family's going to starve this winter! Fuck! Should be enough. Okay, I'm pretty loaded. Things are some gory hole, Nick, Troy, and Tier 1 Omen, the Prime Jove. Oh wow, it's actually low on corn. Alright, I have a corn Kazi though. What the fuck was that? What happened? Oh, I forgot to change it to corn. It said corn Kazi. I assumed it was locked to corn. Shit, I wasted it. Oh, 
I gotta make room here. Prime soup pie and the Risa potato. Oh, here it is. Why? My freedom! Ah! God damn it, it attacked my fucking twin silos here. This is like the farm 9 11. Shit. Give me the corn kazi again. I need- I need corn. I'm having a real hard time getting this thing to actually hit where I need it to. There we go. No? It didn't get the whole- oh my god, this one sucks. I'm never buying this again. Oh, there we go, that was hype. Finally got the whole kit and caboodle. Thanks, Resub Garnome. No way I didn't have enough. What a bunch of baloney! So far, artillery is the best. So we're gonna stick with artillery. This one always hits. And then of course it hits the silo right when I say that. This silo right here in particular is acting like Jupiter to our planet. That's inter like how it intercepts asteroids and shit. This is blocking all of the artillery strikes. Actually all of them. Great, but could have been worse. Brings a tear to your eye. I know. This is what America was founded on. God damn it. Finally, real gaming. Not enough corn. Oh, that was huge. Oh, this was perfect distribution. Whoever's manning the artillery shells, you did a great job. Your country thanks you. Enjoy the green giant. Compliments from your old pal on the farm out here. Sub Dryden. 
Tomatoes, Child's Play, I have a billion of those. You got more tomatoes than the Heinz Ketchup Factory. Peppers, no problem. <clears throat> I am four peppers short. So I'll just use the planting pistol for peppers on this one, to be honest. No way I was short on corn. No fucking way I was short on corn. I'm doing it the old fashioned way by hand. How much corn did I need? I forgot. I don't think it was much, right? Is that enough? Oh, it was 394. Okay, I'm never working by hand again. We have technology for a fucking reason. Where's my artillery shells? Farming like a... 14th century peasant with the machine gun, Jesus Christ. Hopefully just tomatoes, because I have so many of those. Damn. How much more of this? 40 trucks. This is horrible. Artillery is by far the best, so I'll just keep using that. plant two full fields. Give me tomatoes again. Give me tomatoes again. Save me some trouble. You son of a bitch. Yikes, I put way too much grease on that one. Give me tomatoes. We haven't seen tomatoes in years! Ooh, not that one, not that one.
I mean, these are really going far. Oh my god, wait, what did I buy? Wait, what? Why am I not getting this? Oh my god, I was buying the wrong thing! Shit! Ugh, oh, our yield's gonna really suffer because of that. I don't even understand how I was getting the planting one when I was looking at harvesting. Well, might as well use it. It's not the worst. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Wait, how do I only have two? What what is going on? Why am I not buying these anymore? I fucking mag dumped into the harvesting explosives. Which I think is fine. I didn't get any money back off that for some reason. Well, this is going to be a problem now. Oh, I do have some new unlocks. That wasn't very good. Artillery is still better. In the trailer they advertised an AC-130. Is that this one? Yeah. Yeah, that was trash. Never using that again. What a horrible farming tool. Though it might have been giving me more yield. I'm not sure. It looks like it kind of was. Oh, that's so sad. Caught a bad hitbox there. Must have hit a rock in the soil.
Thanks, Resub Prodigy. Alright, I really need money now. Okay. We're back. Man, he, these trucks fucking love the peppers and pumpkins. Why? And how many more do, do I need for this? I really want the AC-130. I don't know why I'm even trying this again, but... I'm gonna let it rip. That one was actually pretty good. This one should also be pretty good. Yeah, not bad. Ugh, that didn't go as far as I thought it would. Just shy. Just fucking shy. Oh, I only got two. Thanks for the DMC. The One Piece Discord owner has beef with you? Why? I like the show. I know Twitter was very upset about me not liking Luffy, but it's it's called being an individual and having a different opinion. Still like the show. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Holy shit, this one's gonna take forever. Please tell me I got the AC-130. Ugh. Ugh. One quick text. TF2 got a major update. I heard. It's about time. How much more? How many trucks have I gone through? Does it tell me? Oh my lord, I still need 16 more. Drone is better yield. Alright, we'll see. I'll try it. Well, I don't need the harvesting drone. That doesn't matter. I can harvest just fine. Oh, but maybe- oh, I see. I see what you're saying. Maybe it harvests more. Yeah, we can try. Yeah, we'll try it over here. Well. Nah, it doesn't change how much gets harvested. I don't know, man. That just seems really bad. 
The uh, planting drone, that is. Like, it's pretty trash yield. Thanks, Risa Bray. This is max. That's max growth. Okay, we'll try. At least this is pretty efficient. The harvester one is definitely worth, but the planting one is certainly not. Like, that'll probably still harvest the whole field. Thanks, Risa Bulfi. Yeah. I do not feel like completing 16 more fucking trucks, though. I'll tell you that much right now. I really want to try the AC-130, but I do not feel like finishing the trucks off. I think I'm just gonna stop here. Jesus Christ. I can't. It's, it's, it's still so much, and it's only gonna get more. Like, if there were more fields, maybe? Let me see what I- I know you can, like, upgrade the houses. Maybe there's something to do with the houses. Or maybe that's in the coming soon thing. And that might be one of the coming soon things. <laughs> Think about the people who will starve. Yeah, I know. That's alright though. They'll they'll just go to a different farm. Things give some cheeks. Alright, I gotta get up early again anyway tomorrow. I'm just gonna call it there. Moist Esports Apex Legends, 9 a.m. baby, winner's bracket. Alright, thanks for tuning in. New subs, welcome aboard. Sub means a lot. Thanks for subbing. Enjoy the emotes. I will see you all tomorrow. Sleep well. I'll send you to Scoots, he's doing magic.